This month here at News 11, we're sponsoring four blood drives in the community. And today we're sharing the story of Mannheim Central grad Kyle Feldstead, who didn't know just how important donating blood was until he needed it himself last year. It was a Sunday afternoon, 24 year old Kyle Feldstead will never forget. I just remember pretty much laying on the ground, kind of not knowing what happened. Last May, the Air Force veteran was home on leave, preparing for his next deployment in just a few days, when a ride on his motorcycle almost cost him his life. A Jeep pulled out in front of him on Route 72 in Mannheim. Unable to avoid it, Kyle and his bike slammed into the back of it. Liver laceration, major, with open wound into cavity. The injuries were extensive. I broke this wrist in two places. Uh, I broke my collarbone, broke my hip, fractured my ankle. Uh, I bruised all of my ribs. I had a uh, lacerated liver, uh, two collapsed lungs, uh, damaged my heart. Um, pretty much everything inside was, was damaged. Less than 8% of people with his injuries live. But there was one thing doctors couldn't repair, the amount of blood Kyle had lost in the accident. I needed six pints of blood for the first day I was in surgery. And then another, a few days later, I needed another pint of blood. So I actually got seven pints of blood. Seven pints in total, the gift from complete strangers helped save his life. I donated blood before one time and I was like, oh man, that's a lot of blood. Like, but it felt good to help people, you know? And then to actually need it on that big of a scale, you know, I. I couldn't really thank those people. Weeks after his accident, Kyle returned to the Northwest EMS station in Mannheim to thank the paramedics. The While he was able to shake their hands, he may never know who donated the blood that now runs okay. through his veins and, and says it's a gift everyone should consider giving. You never know who it could help. You know, it could help your brother, it could help your, your mom, your dad, it could help anybody. And uh, it, it saved my life and it can save other people. If there's a blood drive near you and you can take half hour out of your day to go do it, you should go do it. And if you'd like to help us give the gift of love this February, you can sign up for one of our blood drives. The first tomorrow here in Ephrata from 1 to 6 p.m. The Red Cross will be at Lincoln Fire Company. Donors can sign up online or just walk in. If you can't make it tomorrow, the Red Cross will be back on February 15th at Pioneer Fire Company in Ephrata. And the last stop of the drive will be at the Mannheim Fire Company on Wednesday, February 24th. More information on the drives and how to sign up can be found on our website, brctv11.com.